five four three two one. I'm Wacko Bob here with another report once again. Of course, a lot of people know I host the Dark Match and the Wacko Weekly, and I also have a political show called Liberal Lies versus Conservative Compromise. <laughs> Sounds like a lot there. Sounds like a mile long, but a lot of people might have forgotten that I do have that political show. A lot of it has to do with is because of the fact that I'm not really doing it right now. But I decided I would do a little uh, quickie here about about uh, Anna Nicole Smith, but I do want to remind people that Liberal Lives versus Conservative Compromise will be returning this summer and will pro probably be a morning show. Now, on to today's uh, topics here. Much better. Oops, no, not that much better. <laughs> uh, Anna Nicole Smith, of course, uh, charges have been uh, pressed against uh, Howard K. Stern and uh, the doctors of Anna Nicole Smith, two doctors. And... I was always wondering this, you know, I've been wondering this about Howard K. Stern, and I've been wondering this for a while, about where he goes more so than anyone else. Um, I have issue with uh, what I've, uh, with uh, what I've seen, you know, as far as the news, and how Howard K. Stern has been, uh, basically been getting treated. Howard K. Stern, in my eyes, you know, is someone who is absolutely guilty, in my opinion. I think... And uh, the question is, should criminal charges be pressed against uh, people in the death of Anna Nicole Smith? Absolutely. And I do think it is Howard K. Stern. I think everyone agrees. I think he's responsible for the death of... I think he's responsible for the death of uh, Anna Nicole Smith and Anna Nicole Smith's son. You know, and... Uh, and all Daniel Lynn was going to be was uh, an asset to show what a great human being Anna Nicole or uh, Howard K. Stern is you know that's all that's all that was going to be about and I get sick and tired of hearing this you know and uh, people who uh, really want to talk about what happened there with Anna Nicole Smith you know let's face it she was killed she did OD and there was something more done to, with these prescribed drugs than anything else. There were probably prescribed drugs I don't think she can necessarily handle, but they were messed with a little bit more. And Howard K. Stern, I do think you're behind it. I was happy when I saw saw the actual father actually come out for Daniel Lynn, and I was very happy for her. This had to do with the money Anna Nicole Smith was getting. She was getting a lot of money. Howard K. Stern just simply wanted that, and to get rid of that, you had to... Do whatever you could to kill off whoever. And if you could have been proven the father to to uh, Daniel Lynn, you would have done that too, Howard K. Stern. And I got this, and I got this to say where that goes as well. And this, of course, goes to Howard K. Stern. As you're sitting there in jail, whether you're there or not, you if you ever look at this YouTube, you need to know one thing: I am calling you a killer. I don't think you uh, ha had that much love for Anna Nicole Smith at all. This was about the money. That's why six months beforehand, her son was killed before she was. And I do think you're behind it. You're an unsuccessful businessman. You're a crazy lawyer. And honestly, and this is I'm saying this to everyone, this guy does not deserve any sympathy at all. And I'm glad things did turn out the way they did. Honestly, you knew it wasn't going to last uh, with, last that long with Anna Nicole Smith, and the, and the hand and those quote handlers they had, probably your people. And to uh, Anna Nicole Smith's mother, I've seen you in countless interviews, thinking you were going to do what's best. Let me ask you this. You know, and for those that don't know, I'm doing a YouTube video here at the same time, so this is going to last all of probably 10 minutes at the most. You know, I, I ask, ask you this. How did you know what was best? And that's Anna Nicole Smith's mother. How do you know what was best for your daughter? She didn't want to be anywhere around you. And her last request, if anything would happen to her, was for her to be buried next to her kid. She already had that spot reserved if things happen. She wanted to be buried next to her son, and good for the judge for doing the right thing. Because you were not there for her as much as you want to. I know it hurts that you lost your daughter. And everyone knows that it, it's hurt when they, lose the, when they lose a loved one that they're supposed to be real close with. You know, I know that you probably, if anything, wanted to uh, make up, you know, and really apologize for all the lost time you had with your own daughter. But come on. 
You did not need to bury her near you. This was all about her last request, which, if, if anything should happen to her, she was to be buried next to her son. You know, she loved her son, and I think that proved a lot. Howard K. Stern, you're guilty as charged. And you deserve to go to jail for, for uh, the death of Anna Nicole Smith. Face the facts! I mean, I could go on and on, and I can go... I can go all out about this, but the fact still remains. Anna Nicole Smith is no longer with us, and in the end, no no one's ever going to know the real truth of what was going on between you and Anna Nicole Smith. You know, if you, you know, I I don't mean this to sound I don't mean this to sound like a jerk. You know, and I don't mean this to sound insensitive, but come on. Anna Nicole Smith is lost. Now, not everyone had to be fans of Anna Nicole Smith, you know. <laughs> but, you know, I think I think a lot of us will agree that Anna Nicole Smith probably deserved a lot more, a lot better fate than what she got. She deserved things to be a lot better for her. You know, from her childhood on up to now. You know, and the, and the loss of Anna Nicole Smith, you know... If she could have turned her life around and had real superstardom, that would have been great. That would have been great. That would have been great for her. That would have been great for Daniel Lynn. That would have been great for a lot of people. But I know for a fact that Daniel Lynn is now with uh, with someone, someone who uh, totally does love her and really does care about her. And let's face it, the one who was supposed to get the money now that Anna Nicole Smith is gone, I think a legal trial needs to be done for that, should be put into an account for Daniel Lynn. But uh, that's my story on Anna Nicole Smith, and that's what I'm sticking to. You know, Howard K. Stern, guilty. Howard K. Stern, you should go to jail for a long time. If they reopen the investigation, they also need to reopen the one that went against uh, the death of her son, too. End of discussion.